Now we're going to get into this article talking about the theologians that understood that Peter was talking to the Israelites. Now, um, you got John Calvin. He's one of the popular ones that made the statement that it was evident that the uh, letters of Peter was written to the Israelites. Here it says, theologians throughout the ages conclude it was written to Jews. A straightforward reading of the text indicates that the recipients were Jewish Christian, meaning Israelites. Okay, let's get to the John Calvin uh, situation. It says, John Calvin writing in the 1550s claimed that the recipients were Jewish Christian. See, this is around about the 1550s that John Calvin was joining the other people. But look, it's, it goes on to say Robert Langton writing in the 1650s believed that they were Jewish Christians. John Lightfoot writing in 1679 agreed that the recipients of, were Jewish Christian, meaning Israelites. In fact, he found it incredible that anyone would deny that First Peter was addressed to Jewish believers. He asked uh, rhetorically, who indeed both deny it? Clues in the text that tell us Peter is written to Jews. Okay. It says the description of a former life. In 1, 14 and 18, Peter refers to his readers' former lives with the following phrase, the former lusts which were yours in your ignorance and your futile way of life inherited from your forefathers. See, it is argued that the diaspora Jews of the first century could never have been described in such spiritually bankrupt terms and that they and that the ways of Judaism would never have been described as a useless way of life. Therefore most interpreters today conclude that the original recipient must have been Gentile converts. In 118 Peter refers to their former fruitile way of life inherited from their forefathers. It says in the word used here for forefathers, it says is unique in the New Testament, but there are many similar references to the uh, trans tradition of the Pharisees of the elders and sim or simply of men. This oral law of the Pharisees have been passed down for a number of generations. Okay, they go into something now. Uh, but, yeah, pretty much that's the main thing I want to bring out. John uh, Calvin and a lot of other people made the claim that Peter was written to the Israelites. Let's go into Salakia. Let's go into the scriptures real quick. It says here, First Peter 2.9. It says, but ye are a chosen generation, a royal priesthood, and holy nation. See, Peter was detailed when he said a holy nation. He let it be known that they, there was a nation. What was that one? Uh, 18. 
the tradition of your fathers. It says, For as much as ye know that ye were not redeemed with corruptible things as silver or gold, for your vain conversation received by tradition from your fathers. So he was talking about fathers. This was not no just random people so called believing. And then look at the the um Peter it says I mean first Peter chapter one, I mean verse one. Peter, an apostle of Yahweh Mashiach to the strangers scattered throughout Pontus, Galatia, Cappadocia, Asia, and Bithynia. Uh, now, these strangers scattered, that's let it be known that it's talking about the Israelites, because only the Israelites were scattered. These other people lived in their lands. Now, you have... um. What is it? You have you got the um oh Peter was written. Peter was one of the last books written. Let's see if I can go back to Google and pull that up. That's another situation. Peter was the last one of the last books written because John died when he was 99 in the, uh, in the prison. Uh, okay. It says, Letters of Peter, also called Epistles of St. Peter the Apostle, um, to the New Testament writings. Uh, okay. Okay, let's go into the images real quick. Might give us an outline. Okay. No outline. All right, let's go. Well, let's try this. No, that's not it. Let's look under. It says. Let's see if this give it to Okay. Now this one shows that Peter they're trying to say Peter was written close to the time of uh, Timothy. Let's go back because I've seen the chart that show Peter being last. Where is that chart? So lucky and bad with me. Let's try this. Oh, you know. 
什么呢？Gotta be the New Testament too. Bingo. Oh. Okay, now that's not what I'm looking for. I want the dates on here. See so if we can get some dates. Let's go on to this one. So they. They pretty much trying to say Timothy, Titus, Jude, and Hebrews were written at the same time. Oh. Trying to figure out how they came up with that conclusion. <clears throat> now this one got Peter. Last or oh, got second Peter last and first Peter I don't know what kind of timeline that's about. All right, well I'm gonna leave it there. Um, just want to bring that out. How the guy that vocab following, he said Peter, um, Peter said that the book of Peter was written to the Israelites. That's a powerful situation. But I want to leave it there. All praise to you. How Shimmy? How about Shah? How about Shimmy? Kakadash. Double honest to the other pushing the truth. Peace to the elect worldwide. Our kingdom is at hand. Shalom.